Bowman here at BW1.com. I'm going to show you how to update your Zune HD. The Zune HD recently came out with the firmware update. The firmware update version is 4.3, which is an upgrade from 4.1. This isn't a major upgrade, but it does have some minor improvements in it, especially within the browser. The pages load up faster. It gives you sort of an option to go between desktop and mobile as far as what you want to view on the browser. It has some improvements to the music. The apps load up a little bit faster. So it's overall some minor improvements to it. Now, the update should automatically come out to you Via, um, via just plugging in your um, device, loading up the Zoom software, and it should download automatically. But some people are having a hard time getting it or it doesn't show up at all. So I'm going to show you how to do that here, how to basically manually do it. The first thing you actually need to do on the, de on the device itself is you need to actually set it to system restore mode. This won't erase anything on the device, but it does set it in a way so that the update automatically comes. So the first thing you want to do here on the Zoom is actually you want to turn it on here and you want to hold the power button and the media button here on the side down at the same time. You want to hold it for about 15 seconds. Once you've done that, you see that it says connect Zoom to your PC. So what you want to do is do exactly what it says, connect your Zoom to, Zoom to the PC. You have it plugged in there. And your Zoom software should start automatically. As you can see on the screen, it says player update required. Found that you have uh, the new update available and such. And you just want to click accept here. And the update will begin. This doesn't erase any, uh, any of your um, tracks or anything on your device. So it'll just do a nice clean update for you. All right, once your device loads up after um, rebooting a couple times, you're all set to go and you have to click finish. Well, something you may have to do is you may have to go into device and you might actually have to change the um, sync relationship. You might have to change it to going from a guest connection to a, a regular connection if it shows that it shows up as a guest connection. So you might have to do that. But other than that, you're all set right there. So this is Bowman from BW1.com showing how to update your Zoom HD. So get updating. Reminding you to follow us on Twitter at twitter.com slash bw1.com. Follow us on Ustream. Subscribe to our YouTube page. Give us five stars on this video. And always remember to live your tech world high definition.